from Europe, Africa, and the Middle East. The Museum of Art will receive some exciting new additions for an exhibit dedicated to religion and culture. Join me as I look at this groundbreaking exhibit of Islamic art and why it's here at BYU. While America is flooded with images of Islamic extremists and Muslim terrorist factions, BYU looks to the unseen side of a culture Americans often misunderstand. Beauty and Belief, the newest exhibit of BYU's Museum of Art, features ancient and modern pieces that tell the story of the 1,300-year-old religion. This is a historical moment and a personal moment. BYU and various private donors poured more money, manpower, hours, and effort into this exhibit than any other exhibit before it. The directors say this unprecedented attention was well worth it as the museum went through massive construction to bring these pieces in from all over the world. The pathway of the exhibition will usher many visitors from a state of relative inexperience with Islamic art to a sense of familiarity. The exhibit focuses on the beauty of a culture that many people in Utah just aren't that familiar with. And that's exactly why the exhibit came to BYU. Why Utah? You go to Utah to ski. Yeah, but you can go to Utah to see Islamic art too. The exhibit coordinators say they hope that as we look at this artwork of a seemingly foreign culture, we will see ourselves. A calligraphic piece that says, Allahu khaliqu kulla shay, God, the creator of everything. In this symbol, she says, lies the connection between Islam and the LDS Church, faith, that both Muslims and Mormons can understand each other through a belief and a hope in God, and that through tolerance and not hate, America can repair its ideas of Islam. This spectacular exhibition that you are about to see may be the bravest cultural response to the polarized aftermath of 9-11. The directors of the project say art can bring people together like nothing else can. They believe this is how we come to understand each other, not through political talk and acts of war, but through study and understanding. The members of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints share with their Muslim brothers and sisters a love of beauty. Many Islamic groups already plan to visit campus, and as BYU learns more of their culture, they will come to learn about the LDS faith. There's not a better place in my mind, having lived around the world, travel around the world, than BYU and Utah to, to have this. The museum directors hope that as we turn our view of Islam around to tolerance and embrace, we will see a change in ourselves. The exhibit runs through September, and as it does, it will represent the cooperation between the Muslim and LDS people, not through conflict, but through cooperation and creativity.